What's up guys, Jake here, we're down by the river and I wanna take a moment to show you a recap of my best finds and also the craziest things that happened to me last year. I do this every single year, it's one of my favorite videos to make and I hope you enjoy this. If you do, please leave a like on this, subscribe if you guys are new, but let's get started. Worst pain I've ever felt in my whole life. If there's not videos in the next couple of days, I just want y'all to know that, yeah, I'm freaking hurting. If you're worried about me after the surgery, I wanna give you guys a quick update. Uh, I'm doing great, I'm out of my sling, off all the medication they gave me, feel way more myself. I just wanna say thank you guys so much for all the nice comments. I'm down here by the river, and I have 13 more subscribers to go until I break 10 million subscribers. I'm two subscribers away from 10 million. <laughs> Got it. Crazy. Put your arm with it this way. I think we friggin' did it. Yep. Congratulations. I love you. Thanks. Couldn't tell you how I felt in the moment, but I'm sure you saw it all over my face, man. I don't want to like ever, you know, hide my emotions from you guys because like this means so much to me. And that I'm not gonna fake a reaction and scream and yell or whatever, you know, like that's just not me. Yeah, when I broke a million subscribers, I honestly felt like it changed my life forever. And I'm still getting emotional. Ten million subscribers just Ridiculous. Like, thank y'all so much. You changed my life and I couldn't be more grateful. This is something like I've dreamt about, but I never thought I'd actually do it. YouTube says, Dear D Almighty, at a hundred thousand, we thought not bad. That's a healthy new channel. At a million, we thought, wow, this creator's pretty awesome. But 10 million at this point, we're actually scratching our heads on how on earth did you do that? 10 million subscribers isn't just a lot of people. It's more people than the entire population of New York City. The fact is you're no longer uh, just a great channel. You're a great movement. You've clearly touched a nerve in the world and you found a legion of fans who expect and receive great things from you. We hope you'll accept this Diamond Creator Award as a token of our appreciation and our respect for what you've accomplished. You've amazed us and inspire us every day. Keep it coming. Yours sincerely, Susan. Oh, thank you, Susan. Here we go. Oh, wow. Wow, this is pretty. I can barely lift stuff with my shoulder. All right, you guys ready? Here we go. Ooh, look at that. <laughs> it has its own case and everything. Wow. I never thought I'd actually have my hands on one of these. Wow, look at that. I'm literally shaking holding this right now. This is definitely the greatest accomplishment of my entire life. The only way to continue this journey is to throw it in a river so another river treasure hunter could find it. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I would never do that. I'm gonna cherish this with my life. <laughs> This is the man. We lost two phones today. This is the man. This is the man. He found the phone. Problem to him. I watched his channel for years, man. No way. For real? It's a uh, black, black and green case, waterproof, lifeproof. Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! I got two kids. I respect that. I got four years old and five years old. But you know what? All my pictures are on him. This 
That's all I cared about. That yeah, literally made his entire life. Bro, so cool. literally made my life. <laughs> yeah, this guy helps out the environment, helps out the general public. He's doing a great thing. He's so got some we, happy we, customers over yeah, there. Very happy customers down river here. We love having him here. And it's do the flip, dude. Oh, oh my god! Oh, oh you sorry. Oh my god. I don't even know what to say. Oh, dude, that's the one. Oh. That's it. Oh. That's it. Oh. That, that's Dude. I'm nervous, bro. Now my heart is beating really fast. $1, Shut up, bro. What? It might be a hundred thousand. What? There's stop! No I'm gonna cry. <laughs> this is so beautiful. Oh my gosh. Anyways, good collab, guys. <laughs> My goal is just to get all the stuff that doesn't belong. All the plastic, all the styrofoam. What do you think, up a little bit for this? Just up a little bit. <laughs> I got it! Woo! Hey, I just want to let you know, um, I think I found your phone. You're kidding. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Get another <laughs> iPhone. No. Where was that? On the way? Yeah, no, it was like right over here somewhere. So they were just using the boat ramp in the valley. Yeah, they probably dropped it off the boat. <laughs> That's funny. Well, we got an iPhone or something. Hello. Hello. Oh, Susan again. God. Hey, Susan. Susan from YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> oh, thank you, yeah. She always calls me, dude. Every Whatever, time I find a phone. Dude. It's amazing. I'm showing Jake what I found. It, I don't, it could be nothing, but it, it looks like something pretty bad, so. Why are you holding that? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let me show you my potential murder weapon. Okay. Are you ready? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> you know what that is? What? It's a log roller. No, this is a... Dude, they killed someone with it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Is that it? That's all you got? And a duffel bag. You got something else. And a duffel bag, yeah. You got something else. No, this is really all I got. Oh. <laughs> Obviously, it's most likely not a potential murder weapon. <laughs> but it could. But it could be. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look, 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 come here. Let me wrap it around your neck real quick. I don't like, I don't like this. Yeah. That's perfect, man. I'm telling you. You could have. If you I was a professional log roller, I mean, this would be my <laughs> tool of choice. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that could have been used in the ultimate heist. Or it could be a cover up. Maybe it was my gun. You never know. You know, I threw it out there one day and I'm calling the police about my gun and I'm a criminal. You know, I found a drug lab. Maybe I'm just a drug lord. You know, you just never know. Jake found something really good underwater. Actually, two things that are really good. And uh, this is probably, probably best find of 2020 so far. Oh my god. A gun! <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe I just found this gun and I was looking over, I screamed over, I was like, Chris, come here, look at this. <laughs> but right here, it says 760 Pump Master. I think it's a BB gun. Damn it, how do you get so lucky and find a gun and it's a BB gun? <laughs> so lame. <laughs> this is where the alleged cameraman was for the <laughs> the ring thrower. Yeah. So I'm gonna mark it with a leaf.
Get your phone out, dude. I'm gonna hop in the water, and I need you to line up the exact same spot where you think the ring hit the water. And then I'm just gonna put the metal detector down and just listen, and uh, that could be a great way to find it. I actually almost think you're right on top of it right now. Oh yeah? Yeah. Oh! No way! No way, dude! <laughs> I got it! No, the big one! Whoa! That's the coolest ring I've ever found. Like, oh my goodness. I can't believe it. <laughs> Well, Jake's in water. We're gonna go ahead and get our scoop tanks on. We, we don't have our bicycles, but we're gonna see if we can beat him. I think he's for real just going. Yeah, no, he started his dive, right? Now. <laughs> All right, guys, round it up. <laughs> I feel so bad. That girl over there is yelling at help. That guy's running. He left everyone. He left his girl. <laughs> we're taking the snake. We're plopping it on people's laps and we're trying to get like a headshot with somebody. So we're Listen, trying to get the ultimate freak out. Somebody, either me, you, or Jake. I don't know if I want to do it because you might get punched or something, but I'm you got to wrangle that snake onto their freaking neck. Watch out, watch out. Oh. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out. Oh my lord. Watch out. Oh, watch out, watch out. 
saved you guys. <laughs> it's still got the cap and contents in there, so it's definitely not very old. There's actually a Sweetwater Brewing Company in Gainesville nearby, so this is probably where that came from. Maybe we should pop it open and have a sip. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Oh, it smells so bad. <laughs> Pretty cool. It must mean good luck. <laughs> we are at the back of the dam. <laughs> we uh, are all the way up in here. Remember how we said this was scary? Yeah. We weren't lying. At first glance, I thought this was a foam, but I think it's actually a drug scale, dude. <laughs> I mean, it could just be a scale for anything. Why does it have to be a drug <laughs> scale, you know? <laughs> All right, so I'm not gonna show you guys this in full detail because there's a picture and a full name, but this guy's name is James, and there's appears to be a mugshot. Innocently, I thought this was maybe from like a hospital, but I showed my girlfriend and she thought maybe it was from like a jail. You know, it, looked like the, it doesn't look like the, the most flattering picture of a guy. So yeah, this could be, you know, maybe on the guy's wrist, he cut it off, maybe he got out of jail, or maybe he was doing work or something and he threw it in the river. Oh, I got it, I got it. I understand what happened now. I got this, man. I know what you're up to, James. So he escaped jail, all right? He cut his little wrist thing off, threw it in the water. He had this for his weapon of choice. He mugged a lady for her wallet and stole all that, threw her wallet in there and then got rid of the weapon. Dude, I could be, I could be on CSI or something. If you guys made it to this point, remember this guy's name is James on here. Leave a comment in the comment section saying, find James. He's an escaped convict, supposedly, <laughs> allegedly. If there's people who didn't make it to this point, they're gonna have no idea what's going on. So type in the comment section, find James, if you made it here. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I finally got for out here at three. Yeah, I'd like to give it back to you, bud. I'm gonna hand it over to them. No worries. Dude, they tracked you down. <laughs> they they, they looked... tracked you down by the house. I'm so impressed. That Me is too. really crazy. I cannot believe that you guys do this. It's really amazing. I was literally standing here on Christmas Day and I saw them head out on the sea dudes with the Santa hats. They had the GoPro and they all came back really sad because they didn't have the GoPro. <laughs> That's really amazing. Dude, Steve, come here. Dude, what is this, a bike? Yeah, let me bike. Out. Get down here. Uh, <laughs> All right, we got a bike. First find of the day. Wow. Oh no, he has a skateboard. Oh! <laughs> oh! Yes, dude, that was epic. <laughs> 